Johnny has to get rid of the meatball truck and has to go work for his father. In the front office, learning about inventory, learning how to enter data to develop those tools, Johnny, so we have some stable income, so we bring our debt to zero. You need to focus on the business of the family. I don't know if I could commit to that right now. In four or five years, it's gonna be too late. My window will close. You can tell me that the business has potential, but as it stands today, it has zero value. How do I know that? Because I look at your balance sheet. I looked at every single aspect of your cost versus what you're bringing in, and there's nothing there. If you look at it, you have a six-month business. If it's nice out every single weekend, and if you book an event, this is what you're netting. Yeah. After your expenses, $3,500. All right, so what does that really come out to? You're looking at 75 bucks a week over the course of a year. With the van, that's the best you can do. There's no way around it. So that's a lot but of work. It's something that he... Which I know you guys work hard. I, you know, I'd rather work easy and make more money. I don't know about you guys. It's a great mentor right there. 90 days. All right? 90 days. You gonna give me an answer one way or another in 90 days? Yeah. All right. The time is set. The clock begins. While the meatball business took a step back, Johnny and Megan took a step forward in the last four days. What's still up for debate is can this family make the necessary changes to make the family profitable? It's all on them now. So, Megan, I signed you the role of CEO, but more importantly, CFO. Each month, you had to generate an additional $2,460. Were you able to increase your income? 